Here we have the first proper level of Will Fight for Food, featuring the Marine and Simon. The former you've already met at this point, he too is an ex-WFF fighter, but the main character, Jared, wouldn't consider him a friend. To start off, we're going to show you the most unique part of the game, our conversation system. So we're going to resolve this problem peacefully. Let's go talk to Simon now and convince him to trade his front yard for a cigar. To convince him, we need to increase his opinion of ourselves by using the conversation system and telling him what he wants to hear. Here we have the work in progress conversation system. As you can see, replies are made of three parts. Body language, opinion, and tone. Currently, the UI is still a work in progress, but shows the basic system as well as the hints about the target's personality and how the question should be answered. When you reply, you find out if your reply increased, decreased, or had no effect on the target's opinion of you. While you are free to choose how you speak to people with this system, you need to take into account that you are trying to get something out of them. We hope this system gives you, the player, more freedom in how you approach conversations with NPCs. Here we convince Simon to give us the yard so we can let the Marine stay here. Now that we've helped him out, he might be able to give us some information. We could have easily solved this problem with the Marine by beating up Simon, or we could have done just that to the Marine to help Simon out. We're going to do that right now. In Will Fight for Food, we want to give you, the player, a lot of choice. So if you don't want to talk things out, you can solve the whole game with just violence. Currently, animations are still work in progress, so in the final version, expect a wider variety of moves and hit reactions. You can switch between a peaceful mode and a violent mode to talk to or attack people whenever you want. Now that we've beaten up the Marine and solved Simon's problem with violence, we can ask him to help us out. This decision might come back to haunt us later in the game, but we want players to have that level of choice. Because that's the core feature of World Fight for Food. Choice. We hope you enjoyed this presentation, and if you're interested in World Fight for Food, you can follow us on Twitter, Facebook, or go to our website, pyrodactyl.com.